What's up, YouTube? Well, I've got a new welder. Actually, I've got two new welders, and um, I'm going to put uh, both of these on this cart, and I've got to fabricate a way to um, put this welder, the other welder, and the plasma cutter, in addition to the gas bottles, on here. So I'm going to have to build a frame and um, a way to secure the bottles and all the cables that are associated with the uh, plasma cutter, the MIG welder, and the TIG welder. I'll show you the, uh, all the other stuff that's got to go on the cart as well. Okay, this is my uh, new Lincoln Power MIG 210. It's a multi-process machine. Um, turn it on for you. You can check it out. It's pretty uh, sophisticated. It's actually a lot easier to use because it automatically configures the welder for whatever material you're using you just go through the menu and basically tell it what you're what you're welding and what you're welding with and uh, it sets it up for you but I got to get this cart this uh, welder on that cart with all the cables and um, do it in such a way that the machines are secure so there's the gas, there's the gas bottle that I got to use. That's uh, the 7525 mix for welding steel. And down here is just an oxygen and uh, acetylene tank. Probably not going to put those on the, uh, the cart. I'll probably put those in another location. And there's the, uh, The Miller 375 plasma cutter, and it's got the work cable and the uh, the cutting torch. All this stuff's got to go on the cart here, and uh, that's going to be the project that I'm going to be uh, working on this week. And I'm going to bring you along and show you what I'm doing and give you a tour of the the welder while it's in action. Hopefully, I don't ruin my camera here uh, with the welding. I, I, I probably, I don't know if I'll show the welding itself or not, but um, I, I probably will show you the, at least the result of the, the welding. There's plenty of welding videos on YouTube where people are using uh, pretty high-end cameras to film the actual welding part. Um, they're, they're very expensive, and uh, I, I don't think that would be productive to, to show that part here, but... Um, let me walk around the front of the cabinet and I'll give you a, a little tour of that as well. All right, this is just a simple um, cabinet that I got from Home Depot. That was an absolute disaster this past weekend. But nevertheless, I got the, can uh, the, uh, the toolbox that I needed and it, it's got some fairly deep drawers. I'm going to take all of the components that go with both the TIG welder and the MIG welder and either leave them attached. Most of these cables are, are, are quick cables. Uh, quick uh, disconnect cables and reconnect. So I'll probably disconnect those and then uh, put them in the drawers and that way they're out of the way. They're not getting coated with dust from the other woodworking stuff that I do and uh, they'll all be where they need to be instead of in other places, in other drawers and containers or whatever. So they'll all be with the welders. Um, I'm going to build a base for this out of some of this um, steel tubing. I'm going to weld all that together. Should make for a pretty stable base. So that's going to be the project that's going to be going on here probably for the next week or so. and. Uh, be sure to at least take pictures or film some of that as I go along. So stay tuned and I appreciate you watching.